Um, take on orders. Anti-aging creams. <laughs> to Kyrodata Studio. Top quality underwear. Yeah. Alright. Thomas Sutherland wants his top quality underwear. I don't blame him. Shouldn't skimp out on underwear, man. High performance underwear. <laughs> Alrighty. Should be fine. That's right out. But they're not fully on the network, right? So we can't fabricate goods and stuff. Let me just... Order assigned. Let me double check that. I forgot to see. Yeah, can't do that. Okay. Of course, um, MGS fans will appreciate the Otter Hood. How do I equip it? It's equipped. Oh, okay, it's only in the rain. Okay, so in games like MGS3, for example, you have the Croc Cap. And this instantly reminds me of that. So Kojima likes to give you like these little hats and caps and stuff. And so we've got an otter hood. Nice. Weapons restriction oh. Lifted. How does this even work? Like he's left it here. And if I take this, I mean, I've never had my own bike stolen. So I don't even see how that would be a problem. What does his sign say? Well, this area is crowded, man. I was trying to pick up there. Can you just keep doing this for as long as you like? It seems so. That's interesting. Uh, I was going to say power generator would be kind of useful here. And we've got one. I really don't understand the whole... Um, like motorbike thing. Can you, can you just bring a motorbike and leave it here? I don't know. In any case, I mean, if we've got one, surely that means I can just take it, right? Maybe someone's already taken mine as well, or something. I think I'll leave a sign as well for these people. Um, I'll leave something here. One thing I haven't seen, it says zip line here. I haven't seen a zip line yet. That's actually interesting. That must be a high level thing. I don't know what sign to leave. So there you go. You get to see the otter cat. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his face. That's brilliant. All right, here we go. Oh, we've got time for shelter here as well. Everyone's building everything. This one's oh, it's got the the restoration as well, and we've got BTs. And we're out of the power network again. Let me head back to my own uh, Tidefall shelter and see if I can expand on that. I'd like to upgrade that to a level 2, to be honest. So it seems like this is an area that pretty much always has time for. Oh wait, okay. So this also does that? Hold on. Structure menu. Oh okay, I think it's already been upgraded. Yeah, 
it's, it's gone up from a level... Oh wait, no. It needs it to go up to a level 2. So wasn't there a thing where you can request for people to to like help you with these structures? I thought that was a thing. Okay, well we'll leave that there. Are we close enough to anything to... <laughs> I remember right at the start of the game you could barely hear anything, but now we've got... Like we can communicate much better. Yeah, I'm quite a way away. If this was on... Um, if this place was on the chiral network, then it'd be okay, but because it isn't... Getting those materials is going to be a bit of a problem. So I'll probably just uh, head back now. One thing I'm thinking is that one reason why I don't build things sometimes is because other people have already built it. And I'm thinking, well, at the end of the day, you, the game has a way of kind of filtering out who's built what, and only a, a certain number of them appear in each person's server. Otherwise, you would end up with like hundreds of generators all overlapping each other and all that shit. So I'm thinking, even if I see something, should I still build one anyway so that it appears in other people's games? So even though it, it's not practical in my own game, maybe it's wise to have it anyway. I might give that a go the next time I'm, I'm somewhere where I know it could be useful and I get rights for it. Alright, back on the road. I just love the fact that batteries don't get used while you're on here. It's a godsend. So like for example, there's there's this guy's uh, thing here. Now I'm wondering if I build one as well. Because I'm assuming it's in someone else's game, this person's isn't going to be there. So maybe my one will be there instead. I think it's worth trying. Any PCCs? No, they're in the car. Okay. No, that was a mistake. Didn't mean to do that. Let's just see what happens. We'll eventually come back to this and we'll see if it's got any lights or not. That's how we'll know. Whoops. Sorry, Sam. I can't allow you to build a structure there. Pick a spot outside the sensor ring and try again. So, yeah, we'll see what this does. If it ends up basically not getting any likes, then th there's no point in doing it. But I get the impression that even if even if there is one there, if you plant your own two, then you'll probably still end up, get, end up getting more likes for it. So for that reason, I'm going to go get a couple more PCCs. And we'll get this guy his nice pants. Fancy pants. <laughs> He's happy about that. Make delivery. Top quality underwear. The best of the best. Get them Calvin Klein, son. I'm surprised Kojima didn't get product placement from Calvin Klein. Everything all right, sir? I should be asking you that. You're the one that wearing the fancy pants. Looks good as new. My hat's off to you. There we go. Another S rank in the books. Truck long range level one. Okay. I don't have a lot of materials left in this distribution center, though. 
and my current truck seems to be doing fine. I mean, the like thing seems to be very exponential as well. I guess the more stuff you build, the faster and faster your likes go up. Um, now, fabricate equipment. Yeah, don't have enough of that. What don't I have enough of? Ceramics. Okay. Cool. So, yeah, we'll make... It doesn't matter if you lose these, they're not, they're not all that. I've got a ton of resin and metal anyway. And a couple more of those. Let's go. Uh, see, why can't I just put them straight into my truck? What's in here? We can equip that straight away. And... I think maybe get rid of these. And we'll have to make some more. Uh, fabricate. Alright, I think we're good now. So I'm going to get out there and I'll probably, this is the one I've loaded, I should have recycled it or something, but I didn't put my truck in here, that's why. So yeah, I'm going to try building a watchtower as well. So every distro center I go, basically just build all the stuff and just see what happens. So I'll build a watchtower here. Okay. That's cool. And what else would I really need to build? Bridge, watchtower, generator, time for shelter. Post box. Welcome, Sam. Okay. Complete. Yeah, so with these new structures that we built, we'll, we'll see if they're of any use to anyone. Did I build a post box by accident here? I, I've made this mistake a few times. Um, structure menu. Why do I keep making this mistake? So either this is going to be, either this is going to be a bad idea, and people are going to be annoyed at why have you built something unnecessary here. But there's only one way to find out, because it can't be the case that this person here is the only person who's ever played Death Stranding who's come to this distro center, who's built a power generator. It just can't work like that. So by that logic, surely. Got a, it's got to be useful. This guy's got a thousand lives just for this. So maybe for people that's coming here for the first time, maybe instead of that one, they'll have my one or something, depending on the player and where their server is and which server they're in, etc. And what happened when this was a level two? Charge range boosted, customization slot added. Hmm. What do I need? I need 400 more metals. I wonder if I should. I'll do it at some other point for a different thing that I build. Not now. Alright, here we go.
I'm wondering how lights on top of bridges work. Okay. That would mean that you get pretty much guaranteed lights across somewhere like this. It's all just experimentation to see if I can still be useful and still get some more likes and not have like a well someone else has already done it so I don't need to kind of mentality keeps me active alright we've got the mule problem again like we did last time gotta move fast There we go. Yeah, once you cross the bridge, you're good. Okay, finally, the ride home. Well, to not late city at least. That inverse rainbow. Mountain, not city. Hmm. Hmm. So eventually we're going to be heading around to this side. That'll probably be the next thing. So I'm going to shove a, a speed up here as well. Okay, that's real. For me, this is like almost as good as fast travel. Especially early on, like the first few times I use this, it's going to be like better than fast travel. Just for the simple reason that you get to carry everything. Got to make sure I put this in the garage once I am back in the city. I'm hoping it's time for a little bit more cutscene, man, once we're back there. Yeah, it's mule territory, but it no longer matters. So you hear like a, you hear like a sound cue, and I think when you do that, that's when you're supposed to do that. But yeah, they they don't have a chance. Are we getting free stuff? Don't mind if I do. Construction zone. What do they need? Oh, well, they need a lot. Is the answer? Wait, 884 out of 300. How? I don't know why they build one here. I don't feel like this is a this is a place where you need it. But. Special allies, okay. 
So maybe a bunch of people gave stuff at the same time. That's why it went over the limit. Or someone accidentally gave over the limit. I don't know. So I get a like for picking up people's dropped cargo. Ready? If this was complete, I guess I could have handed that in for sh into the shared cargo. Alright, let's get into town. Another place where it's probably a good idea to drop a sign. Have one of those. And off we go. I need to get this thing fixed up, man. The inside is rusted badly. Decontaminating soon. All clear. Welcome to Sam Porter Bridges. Yeah. Okay, good stuff. South Nut City have had to suffer through a lot of terrorist attacks lately. They've not been receiving supplies regularly either. No one's starving, not yet, but a sense of unease is spreading across the city. We need you to bring them as much as you can of whatever you can. Food, oxytocin, the essentials. You'll also be carrying seeds, earthworm and insect protein paste, organic chemicals, and anti-BT weapons laced with your blood. None of which can be sent via a Cairo printer. A delivery will remind the citizens they're connected to the rest of the country. It will give them hope. And if you can get them connected to the Cairo network, all the better. Something's been nagging at me, though. Fragile checked in a little while ago, saying that due to some instability with the beach, she was having trouble making jumps. Until things settle down, she won't be able to help you out. Fragile's at the distro center south of Lake Knot if you want to hear the rest of the story. I marked a location on your map. Be sure to take a look. By the way, chiral density appears to be increasing across the board. We're currently looking into what kind of impact this might have on Cupid functionality. No need for you to worry about all that, though. Just keep on doing what you do best, huh? Alright, so this looks like a big shipment. 43 kilograms. Is that it? Okay. That's fine. Less than 50% damage. No problem. I don't think I need any of these, to be honest. Let's store that. I'll take a rest once I go to the, the South Knot distro. Okay. We need to do a bit of recycling and stuff. We're going to figure this out. But Unable to process order. Unable to process order. Please stand by until the problem uh, oh, hi, uh, Sam Bridges, I presume. <laughs> Sorry about that. The uh, system seems to be on the fritz. Uh, one of the packages wasn't processed properly and got left out of the order. It says here the client is fragile herself. Someone double tagged it so the system couldn't tell whether it's for Fragile Express or Bridges. <sighs> 
Anywho, really sorry for the hold up and uh, careful. The contents are fragile. <laughs> it is. Okay. Okay, a bit weird. I guess people are so isolated nowadays that it's normal for them to be a bit weird. Small thermonuclear weapon. Excuse me? Uh, die hard when you've got anything to say about that. No? Okay. Emergency provisions, huh? Recycle. Uh, garage. Get my truck back. It's ready to roll. I'm wondering if I can fabricate a long range one. Should I get the long range one? Thank you for your contribution. Let me see, hold on. Fabricate equipment. Hmm. Yeah, if I can make one. Yeah. Okay, no problem. So, hold on. We've got this one. And what about truck number two? The long ranger. Where's the long range truck? Hmm. I'm not sure how that works. Okay. That's better. I don't think these X grenades are really going to be that helpful at this stage. Right. These items here. All loaded up. Good. Alright. Well, that's good enough to me. Okay, I think I'm ready to go. Yeah, okay. So this is the Long Ranger, I believe. And what I can do is donate my old truck. Whose is this? Okay, that's my old one. And wait, what? Oh shit, I accidentally made one too many. Oh well, I can donate this to other people, I guess. I don't mind. This wasn't what I intended. I didn't realise it got moved over there. That wasn't my plan. There you go. Let's go back to black on black. Yeah. All right. Okay, now we're fully set and ready to go. Let's go. So we end up with too many trucks, but too many trucks never hurt anyone. 